Es que cuando yo la vi eh, anunciada en la página de, del Marketplace, no pude evitar decir es mía, yo la quiero. Since I saw her in Facebook Marketplace, I couldn't avoid to say it's mine. Look at this. Look at this. Thank you. Feel better? Eh? Did you feel nice? Did you like it? Wow. Oh my goodness. Thank you so very much. I'm so happy to see you. Welcome home. What about a name? Can we look for a name for you? Oh my God. Thank you. I am so excited to be contenta. Thank you. We are going to look for a name, okay? I love you, chiquita. Amigos, buenas tardes, buenas noches, buenos días, dependiendo la hora que nos estés mirando. Soy tu amiga de las Amitis y vamos a tener una investigación a pedir de boca. Esta niña que ves aquí es la protagonista de la historia de hoy. Thank you so very much for being here. Today I bring you a video that is very excited because it's a story about this little girl that you see over here. Aún no tiene nombre. Pero vamos a ver cómo se va dando la historia con ella. Te voy a ir contando poco a poco y vas a ver qué bonita está. I'm gonna tell you little by little the story of this little girl. And now we are gonna watch the video about how is getting with the things this beautiful and awesome baby. Así es que vamos a empezar. Thank you. Okay, just now. If you can see, she start to light the bullet. Thank you, baby. You see? She start with the light of the bullet. It's pretty faded a little bit because she, I am very far away from her. But she just started, just now. You can see how it's lighting the, the bullet. First time. Primera vez que empezó a prender la bala. Estoy lejos de ella y se ve un poquito, este, ya dejó. She stops. She, she stops. Ya, ya paró. De inicio fue verla eh, inmediatamente dije de aquí soy y voy por ella yo tengo una eh, particular atracción con o sea me atraen las muñecas de ojos rosa no me preguntes por qué pero los ojos rosados para mí son lo máximo en las muñecas entonces yo la vi en la foto esta y yo dije tengo que ir por ella tiene que ser mía I have a particular um, attraction for the dolls like her with beautiful pink eyes make to me a beautiful attraction. So since I saw her, I, I said I have to go to pick her up. This lady has to be for me. So look here. See how beautiful she is. Now she's doing very very nice at communicating with me she's being open and i hope you like the video that i'm 
going to show you right now. Te espero que te guste el video que vamos a ver ahorita. Es acerca de ella. Sigue la investigación. Así es que no te lo pierdas. Vamos a ver. Okay, here we go. You have the meter, you have the lamp, you have a bullet, you have a stick, and you have balls, cat ball. Let me pick up the stick because it falls. Tienes pelotas, tienes el meter, tienes lámpara, tienes balita. Muchas cosas para trabajar. Quiero ponerte un nombre, por eso estoy con esta sesión. I wanna call a name for you. Do you want me to call a name for you? Can you use... Okay, she's writing. Let me make a zoom. Chun. <laughs> Ahí está. There you go. We will call the name like, like right now, ¿ok? Vamos a ponerte un nombre ahora. ¿Ok? Turn it off the lamp. Take the light out. Can you shut the lamp, please, for call a name for you? You can do it. Take the light off. To call a name for you. Apaga la lámpara. Eso. What about... Francis Did you like the name Francis? ¿Te gusta el nombre de Francis? Can you light a lamp for a yes? Francis No What about Rosalba? Did you like the name Rosalba? No. Light the lamp when you hear the name that you like, okay? Do you like the name of Lila? Or Laila? ¿Te gusta el nombre de Lila o Laila? No. Do you like the name Angela? Or Angela? She wants to light a light. And I saw a blink of the mirror. Do you like the name Angela? Or Angel? Can you bright the lamp? Or a ball? Or something. Use your energy. Do you like the name Angela? Angel? Sí, le gusta el nombre de Angela. ¿Te gusta el nombre de Ángel? Do you like the name Angela? Sí. Can you bright the lamp more strongly? Do you like the name Angela? Angel, Angel. ¿Te gusta el nombre de Angela? Angel. That, that is going to be your name. Angela. Ok. Angel. Or Angelique. What about Angelique? Angelina. Do you like Angelina? Or something that has to be with an angel. Sí, mira, sí le gusta. Lola. Do you like something that has to be with angels, right? Write the lamp. You can do it. Push hard in your energy. Push hard in your energy. You can do it. Angela. Angela is the name that we choose for you. I hope you like it. Can you help me with the meter? Si sí le gusta el nombre de Ángela, mira. Si ¿Sí ven. Ok. Ok. 
angel. We call you angel now. And I hope you like it. Okay? I hope you like it, angel. Because you are like an angel. You know it? You are like a beautiful angel. And I love you so much. Do you want to go with us to the bedroom again with the other friends? Do you want to go with us? Do, do you want to stay in the room with us? ¿Quieres irte al cuarto con nosotros? ¿A ver a tus otros amiguitos? ¿A estar con ellos? ¿Quieres ir? Do you would like to go to sleep there again? ¿Eh? Can you bright the meter or can you bright the ball or the stick for me? For a yes answer. ¿Ves que cuando tiene uno el presentimiento no se equivoca uno? Es una niña muy linda. Eh, precisamente hoy tiene dos días que la tengo y ya me prendió la pelota que es muy importante. La tiene allá al lado. Me la acaba de prender y es espectacular la manera en cómo se empieza a trabajar con un espíritu. Es cuestión de tener el feeling acerca de qué espíritu te puede guiar para que vayas por él. Entonces, esa es la manera que yo, como yo trabajo con los espíritus. The way I work with the spirits is by a call. When I see a picture of the vessel and I start feeling like a connection with them because they call you. They can call you through a picture or through a postage or whatever. And then if you feel that call inside of you, you have to go to pick up that doll or that vessel. That is very important for us to feel how they react on us and to follow our feelings in what we think about them. If we perceive they have something, maybe we are not wrong. Si nosotros percibimos algo en un envase o en una muñeca, vamos a decirlo así, eso quiere decir que sí lo estamos percibiendo y que sí puede ser posible. Mira, vamos a ver el video. Let's keep watching. She's riding the... Try to bright the lamp. Can you give me one bright light of the lamp? Can you push harder? For a yes answer. To be ready to go. Let me put the stick again. So in this case she can use the stick she wants. Ready. There you go with the stick. Can you give me one bright light of the lamp? And then we will go. Can you help me with that, Angel? ¿Puedes prender la lámpara fuerte y ya nos vamos a dormir? ¿Puedes prenderla bien fuerte, la lámpara que tienes en el hombro? The lamp that you have on your shoulder. Can you help me with that? Angel. My beautiful angel. Can you do it? Can you make your presence know through the lamp or through the mirror? Can you touch the mirror? The one below you, the black with the with the green dot. Can you help me with that beautiful baby? <laughs> She wants to light the lamp. But I think it's hard for her. It's hard for her. I'm gonna be waiting just for one bright light of the lamp, okay? And after that we will go. I know you want to go. Yo sé que quieres ir. Voy a esperarme que la prendas fuerte. My angel, can you do it please for me? Can you bright the lamp for me strongly? Super strongly. Can you try to do it one time? You can take energy from the battery, from the black device that you have on the legs. You can pull energy from there if you want. You can do it. There is energy inside. You can take it. So please ride the lamp and we will go. One more bright light, angel, my beautiful angel, and we will go to sleep. Eh? 
Don't you wanna go? Don't you wanna meet your other friends? ¿No quieres ir a ver a tus otros amigos? ¿Eh? ¿No quieres estar con ellos y jugar? ¿No quieres ir a verlos? What about my beautiful baby? Are you ready to go? If you give me one bright light of the lamp, we will go. Promise. Look, I'm raising my hand. See? Can you bright the lamp for me, beautiful eyes? Eh? Can you help me with one? Huge shot of the lamp. Are you ready? Lola. Can you help me, baby? Or what about the meter? The one in the bottom? The lamp? It's gonna be the lamp, my angel. Yay! Bravo, bravo. Ready to go, okay? Ready to go. Super ready to go. You are so beautiful. I love you, mamita. Thank you so very much. Wow, she's working with the with the ball. Thank you. Thank you. Oh my goodness. Bravo, Angel. Bravo. You are pretty smart, Angel. Thank you. Ya vieron? Can you do it again for me? I removed the lamp and I put it on the bottom. And I fix the device, the meter, in the middle of the body. I reaccommodate all the devices around her, and she's working with the, with the ball. And I'm super happy, Angel. I just want to know if you can move the meter, the one that you have on your hand, Angel. Can you feel that you have one device on your hand? Ah, la lámpara la está prendiendo. Oh, you can light a lamp there. Can you do it more bright? Bravo, bravo, mamacita linda. Bravo, my angel, bravo. You can do it. Lo puedes hacer, bravo. I love it. I just love the way you work. You are pretty smart, my angel. Can I call you, can I call you angel? What about the meter? Can you move the meter? Can you see the green dot that you have in the middle of your body? ¿Puedes ver el punto verde que está en la mitad de tu cuerpo? ¿Lo puedes ver, Angela? Can you see the green dot? I would like to ask you if you can touch it. The green dot. I know you like the lamp and I know you like the, the, the ball, but I would like to see you touching the mirror, the green dot that is there in your hand. Can you see the dot in your hand? ¿Puedes ver el punto verde en tu mano? ¿Lo puedes ver, Angel? I would like you see moving that dot. If you touch it, it's going to jump to other colors. We have green, yellow, orange, and red. And if you touch it, it will be brightening to the other colors. It's gonna be very nice. Si tú lo tocas, el puntito verde, va a saltar a los otros colores y se va a ver bien bonito. Can you touch it for me only one time? Angel. Miren sus ojos, qué bonitos están. Miren esos ojos. Look those eyes. Es como si estuviera viva. Es como si estuviera viva. Thank you, Angel. Thank you for all the effort that you are doing tonight with me. I really appreciate it. Oh, my God. Thank you so very much for all the effort you are taking tonight with me. I love you. Do you know it? Thank you so very much. I'm very grateful with you because I know you are making an effort 
Thank you, really, I appreciate it. Agradezco mucho el esfuerzo que estás haciendo, pero sé que lo puedes hacer para comunicarte conmigo. Te lo agradezco. Thank you so very much. You are so amazing and super pretty, Angel. Sí, movió el mirror un poquito, brinqueó. Sé que puedes lograrlo. I know that you can do it. You don't have to be shy. This is your home and I hope you like it, eh? I hope you see already everything around and all the friends that you have. We made you company the entire day. Did you saw, did you saw us? ¿Viste que te hicimos compañía todo el día? ¿Viste que estuvimos juntos todos? That's what we want. Make you feel company. And make you feel loved. That's what we want. You are never gonna be alone anymore. Okay? You are never gonna be alone. And you know what? Somebody's coming Monday. Another company that you was having in the other house. I don't know if you remember her. A friend, I think, of you is coming Monday. El lunes voy a traer una compañera tuya. No sé si la recuerdes. Ella va a venir contigo, a estar contigo, para que no te sientas sola y te sientas aún mejor. Qué bonitos ojos. Si vieran cómo le brillan desde aquí. Se ve preciosa. You look awesome. Angel, tus ojos se ven bonitos. Quiere mover el mirror. Está como que blinqueando tantito el punto. I think she wants to move the mirror. And she's brightening a little bit the lamp. Let me put down a esta cosa, bajarla. There. Do you would like to bright the lamp again? Or maybe one more cat ball? Writing, and we are ready to go. I would like you to move the meter, but I respect you, Angel. I respect you so much. Y esta es la historia que se empieza a entretejer con esta hermosa niña que te voy a mostrar aquí. Mira qué linda. ¿Ves lo que te decía yo? Es preciosa. Es hermosa. Tiene los ojos rosa, ¿ves? Y es divina. Es un dulce de niña. As you can see, she has pink eyes. See how beautiful she is. And she's tiny. She's a very well preserved, 30 years old doll. About the brand of Paulinas o Pauline. And she's gorgeous. I am just discovering her. And I will keep watching and investigating her. That's the word. I will continue investigating her to see what else we can have. Voy a continuar eh, investigándola para ver pues cómo nos va. Es una preciosa muñeca de hace 30 años, fechada en el 91 de la marca Pauline. Y... Pues vamos a ver qué nos sigue diciendo en las siguientes investigaciones. Por favor, te pido que me sigas acompañando, te suscribas. Si te gusta el video, pues me regales un dedito arriba y que ponches la campanita de notificaciones de Facebook para que cada vez que suba yo un video, pues vengas a verlo y no te lo pierdas. So, please, if you like the videos about haunted dolls, I ask you. If you can, subscribe. And if you like the video, give me one thumb up and punch the notification bell. So in that way, YouTube will give you an advice every time I load a video and you will come to see me. Muchas gracias por ahora. No nos despedimos porque voy a seguir investigándola más. Pero mira qué hermosa. Y voy a buscarle un nombre porque pues no tiene nombre. I will keep searching on her and I will find a name for her because she doesn't have a name yet. And I hope to see you in the next video. And for now, thank you so very much. Te veo para la próxima. Bueno, nos vemos para la próxima. We'll see you in the next video. Bye.
Thank you.